Rick Carlisle called this a pillow fight defensively, but you guys did something in the fourth quarter to get back in this thing. What did you do defensively to get back into it? Well, I think we tried to just mix it up a little bit uh, into our zone and work on that. Uh, they kind of messed up at the end. They, they didn't know what to do. And, uh, uh, and, uh, we rebound the ball. That, that, that's all. We, we, we get the stops, and uh, that's all we needed. How different is it for you now than, say, two or three weeks ago playing with Dirk and Monte? It just seems like you guys are on a different level groove-wise, really settling in with each other. Yeah, like we say from the beginning, I think we're going to be able to, to get better. I think we got a lot of room for improvement with this team. Everybody's getting you know, feeling more comfortable with each other. Uh, we just got to fight. Like, we know we have to do that to win games, but we can compete against everybody. So, uh, like I said, like tonight, we saw, you know, Houston is a good team. They be, they play really good three quarters, but uh, we keep you know, fighting and fighting, and you know, until the end. Yep, and this is stellar. What is the key to picking out a good skinny tie? What's what's the key to finding a good one? You know, uh, about ties. You know, uh, uh, I'm not great. You know, at that, but yeah, I like you got this. help. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, <laughs> but I like the skinny ties. Yeah, it's a nice one. You wear it well. Congratulations. Nice one. We'll catch you later. Yeah, and it's one and zero. Yeah, right. it's one and zero. The skinny ties. Back to you guys. Hey, thank you. Guys. What was different about the fourth quarter when the ball seemed to move a little bit more? I think, you know, like, I don't know if he moved more or not. I think we just were able to make plays and make those shots. Like, we were shooting open shot at the beginning. We couldn't hit it. Um, it was about confidence. Sometimes when you start getting stops, it looked like offense is getting a little bit easier for everybody. Um, I think that's what happened. I think everybody was getting that confidence back because we were getting stops. As you as you see them attacking so hard early, what do you say in the, in the timeouts to just keep things going? Because the thing was, like, they were hitting every shot. They were shooting like 80%, but we were like down 10, down 9. It wasn't like a crazy, you know, I know we got a point. I think it was like 18 or something like that. But it was like, they're going to keep playing the same way all the time. We knew they're going to they're gonna let us come back in that game. And, you know, that's what we did, just keep playing our game, playing our game, trying to get stops. It was hard for a while. But after we find that soul and, you know, mess them up a little bit at the end.